All right, welcome back. We're going to be doing test out Hybrid Server Pro Core Lab 11.1.6 Share a folder with a second name. So let me explain what we're doing here. So we have on the server, or we're going to have a, a server with a share, a local share already under the D drive users folder. So what we're going to do is going to add a second share name so that it can be accessed uh, for the network path to home folders. So it'll be the IP address of the server or the server name backslash home folders. All right, so let's get started. Start that lab. All right, here we go. So we need to, let's look over this. We need to, first off, get into the corp file. So we know that corp files is gonna be under our Hyper-V manager. So we're going to double click on the corp files. Now make sure that you don't click the, the uh, file explorer down here. You wanna make sure you click this file explorer, which is part of that server. So we're going to go there first, and then we're going to look for the D drive. So we're going to go to this PC, and then we're going to go to the D drive, and oh, there's the users folder. So we found that. So now we need to add an additional share. So we're going to right click on it, go to properties, then we're going to go to sharing, and we can see that it is already shared. So that is the network path. There it is. So backslash backslash or whack whack corp files backslash users so we're going to hit advanced sharing and right here we're going to add a second share name to home folders or i'll add change it to home folders shouldn't say second one home folders all right so uh, okay all this is going to be original so okay cool okay there okay there all right so look there it is so then you can see in the sharings tab that the corp files slash home folders now for the network path and that is what they all they're wanting here so locally it's still going to be users but uh on the network you would be able to access it with the two backslashes ip address or corp files backslash home folders instead of users now so that's how you would access it from another machine on the network all right, so let's score this lab and see what we got. 100% wah-bam. All right, so if you have any questions, please let me know. And I'm going to continue working on some more videos for you. See you next time.